In this video, I'm going to be going over one of my favorite bunch defenses in Madden 22 right now. This blitz is, um, it's a blitzing concept that's going to absolutely gas up the bunch formation while also kind of keeping some really, really good coverage principles in behind it to be able to fend things like wheel routes, to be able to fend things like um, deep corner routes, stuff like that. So a uh, nice little concept here. Uh, for bunch now if you're new to the channel my name is cody we do videos like this every single day that can help you become a better madden player and so if you're looking to get better at the game i'd really encourage you to click the subscribe button it's free to do that uh, it just allows you to stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies that we release here on the channel and we're going to be showing you this um this little blitzing concept against one of the meta formation or uh, meta offenses which is bunch and uh, specifically bunch out of vegas playbook and i think this is actually one of the better blitzing concepts in the entire game and it's one of the many reasons why I really, really recommend that you check out my Big Nickel Over G defensive guide. I'm gonna put a link in the description to my Patreon. By joining the membership, you get everything. You get all of our Madden eBooks, all of our updates to those guides, and uh, any new stuff that we release. We also release kind of exclusive little tweaks and uh, pro tips every week. So if you wanna check that out again, it's only $10 to sign up. I'll put a link to the Patreon in the description if you wanna check it out. Um, but the Big Nickel has kind of become my favorite defense in the scheme for a lot of different reasons. And the biggest one is the pressure that you can create. It's got some of the most unique pressure concepts and really best pressure concepts primarily for bunch uh, in this game. So what we're going to do is we're going to come out with our, our play, our coaching adjustments. We're going to have auto flip off, auto alignment set to baseline, option defense on conservative, and that's pretty much what we have. Now, you can run the slot corner package if you want to. You can also run the standard package. It's up to you. There's pros and cons for both of those. Um, but the play we're going to be using to lock down Gun Bunch is cover two out of Big Nickel over G. You could also, actually, you know what, while I'm thinking about it, I'm going to show you. Um, or no, yeah, we'll use cover two. We'll use cover two. I was going to show you SS Blitz 2, but we'll, we'll save that for a different, uh, a different day. So cover two. And what's really good about this coverage is that the slot corner is on a vert hook. So the setup for the pressure is really simple and we're gonna be able to bag a wheel to the right. So all we have to do is use her, um, basically all we have to do is use her to the left. So what I like to do is show blitz, pinch my D line, crash my D line inside. Now, really, really important, you wanna move this deep half down. This is going to help you with any seam streak to the slot or you know anything like that. Then what we're gonna do is we're going to globally blitz our linebackers. We're gonna shade our coverage down. We're going to um, man up the solo receiver on the left and we're gonna blitz the safety on the right side. Um, before you blitz that safety though, make sure you've QB contained. So you see I'm QB contained and then I blitz the safety and I'm gonna stand right about here. And what you're gonna see is we're gonna get kind of a double pressure, we're gonna get looping pressure and we're going to get edge pressure at the quarterback now why this is so good is because there's one of the most popular ways that people like to pick up pressure at a gun bunch is to go ahead and block the tight end so you'll see here this is again what the defense looks like and you don't even have to worry about that too much but let's just say they block their tight end what you'll notice with this pressure is a lot of times that guy will still come off the edge. Now, the reason he didn't was because I accidentally moved the linebacker. You don't want to move that linebacker once you get him on that contain angle. So you see here, he's on the contain. And then you can actually set this up like ridiculously fast and still have this coverage. So this time I'll block the tight end and you'll see the pressure will come off the edge really fast. You see how fast the pressure comes. That's another real key piece of this defense. So again, you're gonna show blitz, pinch your defense, or pinch your uh, D-line, crash your D-line down, blitz your linebackers, QB contain. From there, we're gonna man up that solo side, side player. We're gonna blitz this guy off the edge. And then that's pretty much all I like to do. I like to shade coverage down if I can, um, and then maybe recloud the bunch side guy just to kind of help with the corner routes and stuff. And now I'll show you what it looks like with a blocked running back. You'll see with a blocked running back, it's still going to come really fast. And that's really the, the beauty of the defense is they can't block the edge rusher. And so that's what makes it so good is it comes in really, really fast. And it's it's fairly simple to set up. Like it really isn't that hard uh, to get the setup in. Now, the other thing I wanna show you is what if they max protect? If they max protect, I found that this edge 
this looper will kind of close the pressure off. And so whenever they max protect though, one of the things that I want to kind of be clear about is they just don't have enough routes, right? They don't have, they don't have the wheel routes to be able to kill you with. They don't have like, there's certain routes they just can't use in a max protect bunch. And so sometimes this edge rusher will get picked up right there, but you see that that looper comes right behind him and he's able to guard that, or he's able to get the sack. So there's not really, there's literally no way that they can pick this up from bunch. And that is, uh, in my opinion, makes all the difference from a coverage perspective. So again, here, I'll show you this time. I won't contain. I want to show you what happens if I don't contain the looper. You see, it doesn't quite come in as well. Sometimes that safety will get picked up on that left side. So that's just something you want to, you know, kind of think about. Now, let's say that you want to do this from, for example, a match coverage. Um, you can actually, this is a really, really good uh, defense from match coverage because they won't have time to hit their bomb concept on the left side. So you see here we have that quarter flat. We could put that into a curl flat if we wanted to. We can also take this guy and put him in a deep half. So now all we have to worry about is a crosser. We know that everything else is going to be pretty much bagged, either a crosser or a wheel to the running back. So you see again, we force max protect. But now if they try to throw this corner route to the right, you see here, they have to throw it by that point and you see it gets taken away. So you, can, you don't have to do this out of cover two. I'm just showing it out of cover two, um, but you can do this out of any play in this formation. I really love this blitz um, from a match perspective, because especially against Bunch, because there's no way for them to pick it up. And they have, um, you know, we have the majority of what you want to do from a match concept completely bagged uh, with this play. So that is a little preview of the big nickel defense if you want to learn the rest of it uh we show you how to bag pretty much every meta offense in this game and it's really 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 good it's probably like i said it's my favorite defense by far this year there's so much you can do from this formation from a pressure pr pressure perspective uh, that people have been sleeping on all year long so thanks for watching the video and if you want to check out my full big nickel over g defense be sure to go to the description of the video. You can click that link there to join the membership. By joining membership, it's only $10 to sign up and it gets you access to all of our Madden 22 eBooks, all the updates to those eBooks and our weekly pro, pro tips as well. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.